I know it was really important for me to get rid of the hobos taking a dump in the playground, but I'm really happy that I actually invested in a gymnasium because now we have a school dance. Now, every one of you leave room for Jesus, okay? One foot in between each of you. I don't want to see anyone poking pissers. Yeah, you split up. <laughs> What's up, guys? Welcome back to the most untrustworthy fart on the internet. Free random games. I say that because we're gonna start things off with a real potential pants turd in a game called Papers Grade, please. Which I'm pretty sure used to be called Grade Papers, please. Like a, a play on the whole Papers Please craze, but trademark, copyright, what you gonna do? Clearly, they want to keep showing up at the top of the search results for a very popular game that isn't actually on the Play Store, which means they're just gonna go with a title that makes absolutely no goddamn sense. Hello, choose your teacher. So, do we want to go with the middle-aged, alcohol-abusing Dora the Explorer? Or Pepe the Frog, who's poorly trying to disguise himself as a human being? Uh, I think we're gonna go with Dora. You know, that way, if I accidentally flirt with one of the students, I won't go to jail for it. Round and round the globe goes, where it stops? She sure doesn't know. I'm sorry, are you guessing Jupiter? I don't need to be a map biologist to tell you that isn't Jupiter. You should know this. You know, like boys go to Mars to get candy bars, girls go to Jupiter to get more stupider. Clearly, you spent a lot of time vacationing there, young lady. I'm incredibly disappointed. You're getting an F. I'm gonna have to have a word with your parents. Tell them to reduce your Christmas or something. How about you? A bunch of ice. <laughs> I mean, she's technically not wrong, but at the same time, like, I, I really can't afford to lose this job. I'm gonna have to give you an F. Why is there no in-between? I wanna give you like a C minus. That'd be good enough. No, okay, well, she's real upset by that. I'm sorry. Come on, do me good. Oh, okay. Well, this wasn't so bad. I'm pretty sure that's Brazil. I'm gonna give you an A and hope that my supervisor tells me that I was correct. All right, six months. We spent six months learning countries and this is what I get. Oh, you have got to be kidding me. Like, I've heard that a lot of teachers need to pay for supplies out of their own pocket, which is ridiculous enough as it is, but I've never heard of a teacher needing to pay for renovations to the jewel. Like $120 of my own money, my life savings can upgrade it to a school. Wonderful. Now once I teach these kids how to read, they'll at least know they're in the right place. It's an all new day, and I just need to keep telling myself that learning is a journey that hopefully ends with unbroken windows. Uh, we need them to draw a flower, and this kid wasn't really paying attention to their names, that's my bad, did a pretty good job. I would say that's a flower. We're gonna give you an A. Draw a cloud. My dog ate the drawing. It would have been less effort to draw another. Do you not know what clouds look like? You can clearly see them through the windows. There's very little glass. <laughs> F, no, bad, you get out of the way. Make a line that connects the two dots. And you drew a smiley face. It really does not pain me to give you another F. <gasps> Got another 120 bucks. Can't wait to piss that away on some windows. Oh, never mind. We can spend our money on either upgrading the playground, upgrading a basketball court, or whatever this is. Kind of looks like a smoking section. I'm gonna hope this is a teacher smoking section. It's an outdoor cafeteria. I just can't win. Let's see what's on the agenda for today, shall we kids? Complete the word. You only needed to fill in one letter, but you managed to pull it off. Good job, blue-haired girl. You finally got one. Find a word. That is the only word in there, I think. Oh, no, you could have went with dig. Cat is acceptable, though. Or tack, maybe? I'm not really sure. Complete the phrase with a fitting verb, and you drew a farting unicorn. I farting unicorn apples. <laughs> I want to give him an A so badly, but at the same time, like, it, it just, I, I, I need the money. Real sorry about this, Dora. That's awkward. 
part of me does feel bad when I can't remember their names. Like, even when we share the same name. But then the other part of me fills with rage as I realize that I have to pay to dress these kids. Like, so much rage right up to the tits. Some of these kids definitely seem like the type who would find sand to be delicious, so I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade our playground to make it a little bit less enticing for hobos to pee in. Oh no. It's home economics protecting your egg baby. So no scratches, no breaks. And you actually did a really good job. What the hell? I, I, I thought for sure you were gonna show up with an omelet, but... You actually dressed it to look like a little baby. Okay, great. Well done. Carry on. Let's see you, young man. Uh, <laughs> technically, no scratches, no breaks. I, I don't suggest painting your baby to look like a little rainbow, but I, I think that's, yeah, good. Okay, and uh, that's a perfectly fine egg. Is this the same egg that I gave you? You sure that everybody did well today? Oh my god. I can't believe it. Are things finally turning around? Was it because I got rid of the hobo piece and? I've got a sneaking suspicion of what happened to our basketball courts. And considering I can fix it for $150, I'm pretty sure we're just painting the grass. Now I need to actually start watching ads because there are bonus levels. I could do recess stuff or gym stuff. All the fun parts of school are locked behind ads. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm here doing basic math. Complete with the right number. Five plus four equals nine. Yes, great job, A plus. Paint two out of four of the circles or two quarters. Yeah, you did it, great, wonderful. Here comes the screw up, find the X. Come on, every time, man. <laughs> it's, it's uncanny. I swear they're doing it on purpose because they can see the vein in my head bulge. I know it was really important for me to get rid of the hobos taking a dump in the playground, but I'm really happy that I actually invested in a gymnasium because now we have a school dance. Now, every one of you leave room for Jesus, okay? One foot in between each of you. I don't want to see anyone poking pissers. Yeah, you split up. <laughs> Break it up. That's right. What are you two up to? Hey, 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 hey. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, calm, calm it down. Calm it down. I'm making a whole lot of money right now. Your, your parents are paying me top dollar to make sure there are going to be no grandkids. If that's the way things work around here, I'd like to continue doing things that don't involve marking, so maybe I can upgrade this even further? I could also probably put some over here, and maybe a little over here. Touch back here. I'm made of money all of a sudden. As soon as you turn on the ads, man, it just comes flooding in. Oh, here we go. You know this is gonna be a problem. It's Diorama Day. Who wants to make a volcano explode? So we need to layer blue and purple in a very specific way. And I'm telling you oh, how to do this. Oh, okay. So I'm kind of just giving you the signals and, and you're following suit very well. Well, if that's the case, then why would I fail any of these kids? If anything screws up, it's going to be my fault. You better believe someone is going to screw up. How about we just go with uh, a bit of a 50-50? Yeah, a little, little something like that. I'm, I'm sure that's gonna, what, explode? That was right? That wasn't right. What? What? <laughs> I'm sorry, hold on a second. If we go with a bit of a 50, actually, you know what, why don't we just top it off with a little bit? Is it just that I need to add pink and blue when that's good enough? So does the goal not matter whatsoever? I don't even know what I'm teaching these kids anymore. It's great work this morning, everybody. I feel like we're really getting somewhere with your education, but it's recess time. And if you see an adult who smells like beer and looks like he wants to relieve himself, then be sure to call a teacher. Just gonna keep an eye out for any weird happenings. Walking around, why am I the same size as all these students? You see what I mean? Like, they're easily late teenagers. Meanwhile, they're... Having a hard time learning how to spell, basic math, really anything like that. They're playing on a playground that doesn't have any hobo piss. You'll notice that we fenced it in. It really stops the hobos. 
Now I know what you're thinking. I said at the very beginning of this that I was a middle-aged alcohol abusing woman, which means I make a perfect gym teacher. I'm a shoe in <laughs> You ready kids? Yeah, we don't need any instructions where we're going. We're just gonna uh, put our heads over here like that. And then our, our arms will go down. Are you following? Kids, are you following? No, okay, hold on a second. Let me just finish this real quick. We're, we're gonna put one arm up there. There we go. Okay, good. And then we're going to rock. Really gotta loosen up those hips, especially when you're my age. <laughs> Make sure that the kidney's still working. There we go. And then the other arm up and arm down. Yeah, good, great. Okay, now we're just gonna keep going back and forth. That is not how spines work, but sure. <laughs> Education, keep it up, but just a couple more and we're done, I guess. Yeah, I feel like we're done. Three random games. Pick up all the dead bodies inside the circle. There should be six of them. Make it quick, the next round is already about to start. <laughs> Talk to me again when you're finished. Don't bother me in any other case. Now get to work. All right, boss. Prick. So, where do I start? I guess I will collect the free corpses on this side of the river first. I guess we're just going in dry for this one. Uh, up next, we have a game called Clean Up Royale. Have you ever wondered how like all these Battle Royale games use the same map over and over and over again, but stuff like the bodies don't pile up? Well, it's because of me. I gotta do all the behind the scenes stuff to make sure that the game is ready for the next match. Like cleaning up the losers. And that is definitely one of the losers. It's all fun and games with Marvel skins and Carlton dancing until someone catches half a dozen arrows in the tits. <laughs> Come on, big guy, let's get out of here. Did I just put him on my back or erase him from existence? Of course, I'm the only thing here that doesn't have a shadow, so uh, unless we come across a mirror, then I guess that's just a question I'm gonna have to ask the boss the next time I call in. Looks like this guy pulled a bit of a Wicked Witch of the West. I'm guessing his gamer tag is the Rock 95 or something. Huh, my mistake. Turns out it's actually Milf Hunter 69, but close enough. No, Milf Hunter 69, I knew you well. Don't worry, we're gonna get you out of here. I joke about how bad these things look, but in all reality, they're fine, okay? We're gonna get them a chug jug, and then uh, I'm sure they'll be able to make a full recovery and live a completely normal life. <laughs> this poor bastard was blown into pieces. Great, now I have to find all the limbs. Let's see, we need five parts. Must be around here somewhere. How do you know it's exactly five parts? This guy's balls could be in a different area code. Yeah, no chug jug is gonna fix that. <laughs> so we've got one piece, we've got two pieces, three pieces, four pieces, five pieces. So maybe I was right? Maybe I'm just really good at my job and assessing these situations quickly? This side is done. Now onto the other side of the river. Right. Yeah, I was gonna say, I, I tried to cross the river, but there's a stop sign. It won't let me. As if I'm worried about boat traffic coming from outside the circle. I wonder if I could leave the circle. Okay, if I walk down the road or, or swam down the river right now, would I die? Is it still on? I'm probably not gonna try. You know, best case scenario, it doesn't do anything. Worst case scenario, I die and it wasn't worth the laugh. Do you guys think this guy won? Nothing quite says winner, winner, chicken dinner, like becoming roadkill. <gasps> what do you think did this to him? Something hauled ass through this field and clearly ran over at least a couple of people. <laughs> Am I gonna have to get him out from under there? To scrape this guy off the tree, I have to push the jeep out of the way first. Okay, I do need to. I figured well, his... that didn't go according to plan. Much? Whoops. You okay? Someone took your pants after running you over? That's insult to injury. <laughs> All right, uh, one more. One more. Wouldn't be in the tree, would he? Man, I don't know, he could be decimated. There's no way he's in the cornfield. 
right? And like, I doubt he'd be outside the circle, so it must just be that this shortcut will lead me to him. Hopefully. Oh Christ, are you kidding me? <sighs> I guess I will have to find another way back then. How? I don't understand. I, I was gone for seconds. The car was nowhere near it. It went into the river. Oh, I don't suppose it, like, flowed down and broke it. Oh, okay, oh, I gotta find another way across. Let me guess, over here somewhere? Probably wherever I'm gonna find the final body? I haven't fallen through the map yet, so I can't imagine I'm too far out of bounds. What is this? Campsite? That's what you get if you just wait for someone to come by. He must have bored himself to death. He's a camper. Ha 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 joke, and he literally just died of boredom, I guess. He's a skeleton now, or a really fancy skin. Can Collected I... all the bodies. Now I just have to go back to the telephone tree in the middle of the map and speak to my boss. Easy enough. He didn't want to be bothered until I had finished everything. Wait, now that I'm done, how am I going to get over there? Get the bridges out. And there I... should there should be a tunnel. There should there, there should be a tunnel oh. on top of that hill in the forest over there. Yeah, you can tell it's a battle royale game because there's still some glitches. Tunnel in the forest? Tunnel in the forest? What? Under this rock must be the maintenance tunnel. If I remember correctly, I just have to knock on it three times. Okay, that's definitely a place to hide a tunnel. I'm just going to knock. That not work? Knock, knock. There we go. I just have to go through it and I will come out right at the center. I should talk to my boss ASAP. They're silent knocks, okay? It's a rock. I'm not exactly trying to enter someone's home. <laughs> just gonna climb down. Ooh, would you look at this? Okay. I do understand why people take part in this. There must be a huge paycheck waiting for whoever wins this thing. It's probably three times as much as I'm making. Maybe I should try it for once. Do you earn anything? Because it could be three times what you're earning if you don't earn anything. We good? Yeah, we made it across. Okay, hey boss, I'm, I'm good to go. Excuse me, sir. I'm done with all the buddies now. Took you long enough. You're going to feel your incompetence on your paycheck. Besides, we're not even close to done. You still have to collect the other 85 bodies that are outside the zone scattered around the map. Now wait a minute while I disable the zone barrier. I don't actually need to do that, do I? Why isn't this working? I'm sure this button should. Restarting systems. Wait, what? No! Boss, I'm still in here! Hello? Anyone? I really don't want to participate in a battle- I'm not an enemy! Wow. I'm just from the cleanup crew! I Okay, I guess I'm the loser now. Three random games. Our final game for today is called Pre-Shave. Why, you may be asking? Well, good, that's what you should be asking during three random games. <laughs> because I said so, that's why. That's why I have my electric toothbrush and my shoulder is uh, well, very limber to say the least. Let's just put that down. Oh, I can control both hands. Okay, well, we just want to kind of... Oh, keep keep the blade away. Yeah, we don't want that anywhere near us. We, we want to grab... There we go. That's the good stuff. Uh, elbow? Could, could, you, could you maybe... There, perfect. Okay, time to trim this hairy forest. I couldn't agree more. Let's start with the important parts, okay? We're gonna get the nips out. There's one nip, like to see it. And there's another nip. Where's left nip? Don't tell me I accidentally cut off left nip. That is not a good start. <laughs> I'm being dead serious right now. Where is it? Oh, yeah, I know it's just gonna grow back, but the nipple isn't. Come on now, you free the belly button. I'm working on it. Okay, there is the belly button. Good. We still have a belly button. Kind of hard to cut those off. <laughs> oh, we're not gonna check down there. Okay, fine. I guess we're not gonna head out with the ladies then. Just shaving everything else for some reason. 
can't say I've ever shaved my stomach before. I'm a bit of a hairy dude. I don't suppose, oh, oh, okay. There, there's old left nip, I found it. It just needed some coaxing from the toothbrush. I don't understand why I need two hands. What is the toothbrush accomplishing? Can I, can I put it down? I just, I, I just want the, okay. I just want to get the arm out of the way. That is not how you shave an armpit. Oh, screw it. No, I, I give up. I give up on any kind of sense of normalcy here. Okay, we're just gonna try our best to get everything. Get the shoulders. I know, I know it's just gonna grow back. Okay, would you rather I, I don't? Oh, we already got the armpits. Okay, good. Uh, oh no. Oh, a clean shave. Oh, boo. That's lame. All right, well. For some reason, we're leaving behind face stubble, but no tit stubble. Strange. Okay, well, I guess we just need to use the blade. Should I be going all the way for the, oh, you're gonna go for the haircut too. Okay, well, we could just do the sides. Oh! I just, oh, okay. I'm I'm real sorry about that. We gotta, we gotta even it out. If you get one eyebrow, you gotta go with both. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, if you didn't want to lose an eyebrow, then you should have told your elbows to make sense, okay? That's just the way the world works. Uh, I think we're good. Now, or, nope, nope, don't want whatever that is. I think that's the phone. No, we, we just we just want the... There's, there's, there's just, just nothing. Everything that I don't want goes over there, okay? We just want... And, there it goes. Okay, and... Uh, oh, no, I need cream. Okay, hold on. That goes away. That goes away. And uh, mm, mm, no, no, that goes over there. Yeah, I, I can't do both at the same time. Oh my god, this is impossible. There, there. Cream, cream, cream. That's deodorant. Oh, we're gonna smell great. Okay, we, we got both sides deodorized. Get rid of the freaking tooth. Don't tell me I need to brush my teeth through all this hair. Oh my god. There, cream. Did I, did I cream up? I can't, no, I, I wiped it off. I don't, I don't want to wipe it off. I want to, mm, there we go. There we go. That's, that's the good stuff. Do we need more? Probably need more, right? Oh, yes. Yes, it's glorious. <laughs> the eyebrows are gone, but that's fine. Now, this is the part where you actually need to be very careful and, and probably go with the grain, against the grain, it's been a while. Oh, oh, we gotta, there we go, just gotta wash that off. There we go. No, watch the eyes. Okay, you know what, screw it. We're, we're just gonna, we're just gonna do a little, little something like that. We're just gonna get it done real quick because who cares, right? It's not like you're gonna go and lose a nip or an eyebrow or something like that. Yep, yeah, mm, who cares, perfect. Should rinse off. Are we, are we good? I think that's good. Is there something else I'm supposed to do? Can't shave up here. Okay, what do you feel like next? When did this start growing here? When did what start growing here? Be, be specific. Okay, hold on, let's check the phone. Time to go already. Yes, yes, please, let's go. Yeah, this looks pretty good this time. I, I, I'm, I think we're, we're good, right? We can go, where, where are we going? I still didn't get filled in with that memo. May I see your ID, sir? Oh, we're getting on a plane? Uh, Yeah, yeah, sure, sure, here you go. That's for you. Could you state your name, please? Uh, don't don't mind my twitch. Yeah, sure. Um, Sam. I'm sweating. Hold on, I'll I'll, I'll get that. Woo! Just gonna dab on this guy real quick. Boom! <laughs> Thank you, sir. You've been randomly chosen for a security check. Oh, son of a. So what you're saying is I should have shaved my butthole? <laughs> this was the best game I played. I can't believe this was the best game I played today. God damn it. You know what, I think that's gonna be it for this episode of Three Random Games, guys. And I gotta say, I love this series so much. And it really goes to show that any game can be a complete turd or a complete gem. You just need to give them a try. And I've got some ideas for a Christmas episode. So if you guys have any recommendations for short, stupid, funny, random Christmas games, leave a recommendation, maybe I'll be able to add them, and then I'll return in the holiday season to play more stuff like this soon. But thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Bye.